Hello, ladies and sirs. Sorry. Hello, ladies and sirs. This is Matt here, and we're here to talk about records, and one record in particular, and that is the debut album by none other than Metallica. My all-time favorite band, my favorite band since I was 12 years old. I've seen them live numerous times. This record came out July 25th, 1983, and it was Metallica's debut album on Megaforce Records. When this album was being recorded, they originally wanted to call this album Metal Up Your Ass. And to give you an idea of that album cover, I actually have it right here. Check out that album cover. The big title, Metal Up Your Ass, the toilet with the sword sticking out. I mean, it's a very clear statement. Metal Up Your Ass. The band originally featured Dave Mustaine on lead guitar, who would later go on to form rival band Megadeth. He's got many songwriting credits on this album, and I think he's got one or two on the follow-up album, Ride the Lightning. Dave would be replaced by Kirk Hammett, formerly of the band Exodus, to form the classic Metallica lineup. This album is especially vital because it would set the tone for American thrash metal. In my opinion, this is the absolute definition of thrash metal. Some would say Bonded by Blood by Exodus. Some would say Random Blood by Slayer. Some would say Rust in Peace by Megadeth. And nobody's wrong. And as far as standout track, it's just a banger all the way through. Every one of them is just a Metallica staple. They played all these songs live numerous times. Seek and Destroy, Whiplash, Four Horsemen. I'm gonna go with the album closer, Metal Militia. That was always one of my favorite Metallica songs. You can't go wrong with an album this iconic. So yeah, there you go. Metallica, kill them all. Or, metal up your ass. I think they should have stuck with that, to be honest with you. Who needs the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame? They're a bunch of wankers anyway.